And a truly shocking incident of gun violence today in the Bronx. Police are now searching for the gunman who opened fire inside Jacoby Hospital. One person was shot and others were just inches away from this gunfire. CBS 2's Ali Bauman reports. I was in the vicinity, but you know what I'm trying to say? I saw the blood. I heard the shot. Surveillance video shows the suspect dressed in all black in the waiting room of Jacoby Hospital when he suddenly pulls out a gun and starts shooting a 35-year-old man in the blue hoodie. I heard the first one and I ran into the room. I barricaded myself. Christopher Batances hid while the hospital went into lockdown. You know, I was scared for my life. You don't expect it to happen in the hospital, so a little shooken up. This happened around noon Tuesday. Police say the victim was waiting to see a doctor when the suspect came in to visit a patient. Investigators believe the two previously knew each other and recognized one another inside. We need to work together to get these guns off our streets. Sources tell us the victim was shot in his arm and underwent surgery. The suspect took off running. The mayor needs to step up because now this is getting ridiculous. People can't even come to the emergency room now. Before Mayor Adams came to visit the victim here on Tuesday, he spent the day defending his plans to combat the city's gun violence, which includes bringing back the NYPD's anti-gun unit. We are going to learn from the past so we don't repeat the past. The new units will be sent to the 30 precincts, which account for 80% of gun crimes. I do want to know what those units will be focused on that we aren't already doing. The NYPD's anti-crime unit was disbanded in 2020. Some fear Adams' reimagined version will bring a return of stop and frisk to communities of color. And we would never use under my administration any abusive, targeting tactics that goes after people based on their ethnicity and where they live. The mayor's proposals also include using facial recognition to identify people who carry guns and selectively appointing judges who are committed to cracking down on violent offenders. In the Morris Park section of the Bronx, Ali Bauman, CBS 2 News. Mayor Adams says the new anti-gun units will also be outfitted with body cameras.